lullabies of bone and rust. The rusted gears of the Ferris wheel groaned above her, echoing in the desolate amusement park. Amelia clutched her tattered teddy bear, its yellowing fur matted with tears, the only source of warmth in the bone-chilling night. She shouldn't have wandered off. Now, swallowed by the skeletal remains of forgotten laughter, she was lost. A faint melody drifted on the wind, a twisted lullaby carried on the rusty hinges of a carousel. The notes, each off-key and jagged, scraped against her sanity. Curiosity flickered, its fragile flame barely holding back the encroaching terror. Drawn by the unsettling song, Amelia stumbled towards the carousel, its painted horses frozen mid-gallop, their painted smiles mocking her loneliness. In the center, a solitary figure sat on a chipped wooden horse. A woman, shrouded in shadows, swayed gently, her back to Amelia. As the final note of the lullaby dissolved into the night, the woman turned, revealing a face like cracked china, her eyes two pits of bottomless black. Lost, little one, she rasped, her voice the rusty creak of the park itself. Amelia's scream died in her throat, replaced by a chilling fascination. The woman beckoned, her skeletal hand beckoning, a silver charm dangling from her wrist, a tiny carousel horse, identical to the one Amelia clutched. With a slow, chilling grin, the woman began to hum, the same warped melody. It seeped into Amelia's mind, twisting her memories, replacing them with scenes of laughter and music from a childhood long gone. Her teddy bear slipped from her numb fingers, replaced by the silver charm, cold and heavy in her palm. Amelia climbed onto the carousel, the wooden horse creaking as she settled in. The woman's smile widened, revealing needle-sharp teeth. As the melody reached a crescendo, the ground began to spin. The horses blurred, dissolving into a whirl of skeletal shapes. Amelia's screams merged with the lullaby, becoming part of the twisted song forever. The next morning, the rusty gates of the amusement park creaked open, admitting the first rays of dawn. Inside, the carousel spun silently, no rider in sight. But on the ground, beneath the cracked paint of a chipped wooden horse, lay a tattered teddy bear, its yellow fur stained with rust-colored tears. And in the cold stillness of the park, a faint echo lingered, a warped lullaby sung by a voice of bone and rust. Subscribe for more creepy and ghostly experiences to my channel.